Yo, what is up, camp fam? Welcome back to our channel. If you're new to our channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now and you turn on your post notifications to stay tuned to our family adventures. This is Abella's fourth birthday party. And as you know, Chamley equals Chamley plus Chamley for Abella. <laughs> so we're throwing her fourth birthday party here at Gaga's house, her favorite person in the world. So come and join us on this adventure. I present to you the mermaid princess birthday girl. When I look at Abella, like I, I never really see how much she changes until I look at old videos of her, th like when she was three, mm -hmm. like for her third birthday party, and then like I see like how much she's developed her speech, everything, like the way she tells stories. I've always said this about Abella since the day that she was born. She's she was born to be something great and something big, and in the past year, she's shown us that not only does she have confidence in herself but she's willing to try new things absolutely fearless and i've been saying this for a very long time um, but i think in the past year i've watched her continue to grow as a as a young little girl and it's been a blessing to see her thrive i think also how much like of the big sister role she's taken on she does everything and anything for her little brother and every time she introduces her little brother she makes sure to say this is my little brother neo <laughs> these are his cochleers <laughs> <laughs> um so she's just very proud of like the the brother she has she doesn't wish he was any different she loves him the way she is um, and she's just a really great big, big sister oh also this is the biggest fourth birthday party <laughs> I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and your mommy put this together so you could thank her for that. Hi, welcome to my birthday party. Abella, what does channel plus family mean? Channel means chumming plus equals channel. Yeah, and we're also going on this side. Are you guys scared to do the slide? No. Oh, no? All right, let's go. Wait. Yeah. I literally was crying last night looking at a video and in the video I wrote uh, like in quotations because Abella would always say this she would always say <laughs> um, Abella would always say mommy and daddy one day I'm gonna be big enough to do this and I was crying yesterday because I made a video of her on this big inflatable slide that Giant. she was doing yeah that she was doing at the fair <laughs> and that's one of the things she couldn't wait to be big enough to do because she was always too short and now she was finally tall enough and it just made me cry because looking at those quotes of always oh, thought I'm big enough to do this and then watching her do this thing where she's big enough to do this now and then it cuts to where she was a baby and just to see how fast the time flew by, it feels like I blinked and she went from being a baby, just laying down, not being able to do anything, to going and doing all these things that she couldn't wait to do. I think what Abella teaches us is, is the, she really allows us to be present. Although she's moving really fast and she's very, very quick in the way that she does everything, Somehow she teaches us how, how to be present. Yesterday she held my cheeks and she goes, I'm gonna be four, mommy. And I, I, you know, you, you, it's like you get a flashback of like the very first time that I held her and now she's holding me and telling me this. And then she said to me, you know, I'm never gonna be three again. 
And that put a lot of things into perspective because in so many ways she was trying to tell me like, I'm gonna continue to grow. I'm not gonna stop. This is gonna continue to happen and let's try to make the best out of it. And I think Abella in so many ways not just to me and her dad, but to her brother too. She really teaches us how to make the best out of everything. And she's so smart and, and she's bright. And it's really interesting to just see how other people also speak about her and how she carries herself around others and, and the, the light that she brings to everyone that is just lucky enough to be around her. So she's not just a blessing to us, she's a blessing to other people. <laughs> My favorite memory with you was a couple of them, but they're all this, not the same, they're unique in their own way. You started to get your nails done this year and you couldn't wait. When you were three, you always wanted to go, but you were too small to go. And so now when we get our nails done, it's such a fun thing to do because you're, you know everything that you want, you know exactly what you want and the way that you do it is so, it's so fun to watch and I love it when she says, girls time, because <laughs> it's so you, you're very alive and you're full of life and joy and I just watch you like when you're getting your nails done, I just like keep it and just watch you and it's just so interesting too. In a lot of ways you don't know this, but I had a very different childhood than you do and To, to be able to, to give that to you has been the biggest blessing because you appreciate everything. So guys, we're going on our bed. Yeah, and then. Oh, tell them it's your birthday today. It's my birthday today. And she's having so much fun. And you make me want to do even better than I'm doing now. And as, as a woman, in this world you will learn that a lot is going to be required of you but i hope that through our girls time you learn the importance of taking care of yourself and that you always hold on to that i could sit here and tell stories about you all day long but i want you to enjoy your day and i want to go enjoy it with you <laughs> yeah <laughs>